Ever found yourself lost in thought, considering the mystery of why the Sahara Desert, renowned as the most extensive hot desert across the globe, continues to expand, growing bigger and more formidable with each passing year? This unstoppable, relentless growth of the Sahara isn't a random occurrence, it's an identified phenomenon, a process we refer to as desertification. The term, desertification, sounds just as it appears. A vivid depiction of the transformative journey from land that was once teeming with fertility and life, into a barren, arid desert. Digging deeper into the concept of desertification, we realize it is an environmental puzzle significance, an escalating problem that's primarily driven by an intricate mix of both natural factors and human-induced elements. These aren't simple, straightforward factors. They're complex and multifaceted, ranging from the broad and ambiguous climate change that encompasses shifting weather patterns and rising global temperatures to overgrazing, which signifies the excessive consumption of plant life by livestock to the point of environmental damage. In addition to this, it is important to consider deforestation, the practice of clearing vast areas of forests for non-forest use, such as farming or urban development, leading to a severe loss of vegetation cover. And let's not forget poor agricultural practices. These often result from a lack of awareness or resources, resulting in soil degradation, loss of biodiversity, and depletion of water resources. Desertification is indeed a critical environmental challenge, primarily driven by both natural and human-induced factors. These factors include climate change, overgrazing, deforestation, and poor agricultural practices. Climate change with its irregular rainfall patterns and increased evaporation rates has pronounced impacts that deeply intensify desertification processes. The erratic weather conditions it brings, such as long periods of drought followed by heavy rains, cause a significant shift in the balance of our ecosystem, the transformed climate scenario worsens the evaporation rates, affecting the worldwide water cycle and causing more severe and longer-lasting droughts. The effects of desertification are not merely environmental but wreak havoc on the socio-economic structure of the affected regions as well. One major catalyst for this hazardous condition is overgrazing by livestock. Overgrazing leads to compaction of the soil, which reduces its capacity to absorb water, promoting erosion eventually resulting in desert-like conditions. It's a chain reaction where the livestock, by their sheer numbers and feeding habits, strip the land bare, stunting plant growth and leaving the soil exposed. Another significant factor accelerating desertification is deforestation. When forests are cut down, the land is left exposed and vulnerable to wind erosion. With the protective cover of trees and vegetation gone, the soil dries up. It loses its moisture and nutrients, transforming into an unproductive and barren landmass. Moreover, poor agricultural practices also play a detrimental role in desertification. Excessive tilling, for example, disrupts the soil structure. It causes the soil to lose its integrity, making it susceptible to being swept away by wind and water. This issue is further compounded by lack of knowledge and awareness about sustainable farming methods among the farming community. Poor agricultural practices also contribute to this issue. Excessive tilling, for instance, breaks up the soil structure, making it susceptible to being swept away by wind and water. The effects of desertification are far-reaching, impacting not just the local communities, but also the ecosystems. Desertification, a grave environmental concern, has a ripple effect on various aspects of life. It acts as a catalyst in reducing agricultural productivity on regional levels, posing a significant threat to food security and livelihoods. The dwindling productivity often leads to a cycle of poverty and displacement, affecting the socio-economic fabric of such communities. Moreover, desertification exacerbates water scarcity, a formidable challenge that humanity faces in the 21st century. The transformation of fertile land into arid zones causes the soil to lose its water retention capabilities. The parched soil becomes less capable of storing water, thereby intensifying the water crisis. This lack of readily available water sources makes survival even more challenging in affected regions. Adding to the woes, ecosystems bear a considerable part of the damage caused by desertification. The constant degradation of land leads to loss of habitats, dealing a severe blow to biodiversity. The once thriving habitats turn into barren landscapes, unable to sustain the life they once did. The loss in biodiversity, consequentially, disrupts the balance of the ecosystem. 
This not only affects wildlife, leading to extinction of specific species, but also impacts climate patterns. The loss of plant species in particular disrupts the balance of, they play a crucial role in maintaining the health of our planet, their disappearance affects wildlife and alters climate patterns on a global scale. The effects of desertification are indeed far-reaching and grave, demanding immediate attention. The loss of plant species disrupts the balance of the ecosystem, affecting wildlife and even climate patterns. But even in the face of such an overwhelming issue, there is hope. The world is now waking up to the immense challenge that desertification presents, and efforts are being made to counter this issue. Numerous strategies are being proposed, explored and implemented, each with a unique approach to combat this problem. One noteworthy solution that is gaining across the globe is sustainable land management. Sustainable land management is a versatile approach that values the preservation and restoration of it, encourages the adoption of practices that not only protect the soil, but also restore its health and vitality. Technologies like agroforestry or contour plowing offer great promise. Agroforestry, the practice of integrating trees into farming systems, can greatly improve soil fertility and biomass production. Similarly, contour plowing, a method of tilling that follows the natural contours of the land, can reduce soil erosion and increase water retention. Another potential solution that is gathering momentum is the creation of green belts. Green belts are essentially rows or blocks of trees planted purposefully to shelter the land from wind erosion thereby minimizing soil loss and to increase soil moisture, enhancing its productivity. These green belts can act as natural barricades, protecting vulnerable areas from the harsh and destructive forces of desertification. A flagship example of this strategy is the Great Green Wall Initiative in Africa. This project aims to grow an 80-kilometer wide stretch of trees across the continent. The target is to reclaim and rejuvenate degraded land, improve the livelihoods of those affected, and counter the pressing threat of desertification. The Great Green Wall, once completed, will be a testament to the power of collective action and innovative environmental strategies. The Great Green Wall in Africa, an ambitious initiative aiming to grow an 80-kilometer wide stretch of trees across the continent, is a shining example of this strategy. In conclusion, desertification is a pressing environmental concern, provoked by aspects such as climate change, overgrazing, and deforestation. It's also propagated by inadequate agricultural practices. These factors significantly contribute to the worsening state of our planet. The repercussions are harsh, impacting local communities' means of survival, their food supplies and water resources. It affects biodiversity and habitats of many ecosystems. Yet we're not powerless in the face of such challenges. Sustainable land management strategies can serve as a lifeline. Innovative procedures such as green belts can also help in the fight against desertification. These methods provide a glimmer of hope, demonstrating our ability to ward off the impending threat. Desertification isn't merely about the Sahara's spread. It's more profound. It's about the existence and prosperity of many lives and livelihoods. It's about the and future of our planet. As we progress, it's crucial to comprehend and address this urgent issue. We must remember that every grain of sand counts. Every step we take, every action we initiate is vital in shaping the world of tomorrow. It's imperative to act now and protect our precious Earth, because every grain of sand counts and every action we take shapes the world of tomorrow. That we've given you an overview of the urgent issue of desertification, let's dive deeper. We'll first examine the causes going beyond just climate change and deforestation. Urban sprawl has emerged as a noteworthy contributor, leading to the loss of agricultural land and consequently exacerbating desertification. Political and socio-economic influences, such as land tenure and poverty, play their part as well, further complicating this environmental issue. We'll then shift our focus to the impact of desertification on local communities and ecosystems. It's not just about dwindling food supplies or scarcity of water. This issue affects social stability, triggers migration, and changes life as we know it. We'll shed light on these aspects through insightful case studies from diverse regions, showing the different ways this crisis manifests and the human cost it entails. Of course, understanding the problem is only the first step. We'll round off this exploration by highlighting potential solutions. From sustainable land management to green belts, Many initiatives are already making a difference. However, more innovation is needed to tackle this global issue effectively. 
we'll spotlight some pioneering projects and technologies, such as desert greening initiatives and drone reforestation, that are turning the tide against desertification. These will be discussed in detail, providing inspiration and hope in our collective fight against this calamity. Desertification is a multifaceted problem, but with comprehension, resolve and concerted efforts, we can turn things around. Every action, no matter how small, can contribute to creating a more sustainable future. Remember every grain of sand counts, and each step we take can help shape a better world for tomorrow. Stay tuned as we continue this essential conversation on desertification.